Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel Salesforce. This is Rohit and today I'm going to discuss about Summer 24 new feature regarding this admin that is organize and find record easily with personal labels. So if you want to learn something new, so please watch this video until end and don't skip any part of this video. And also you can subscribe the channel, also you can turn on the bell icon for more updates so you never will miss any kind of update from my site. So let's get it started without any further delay. So first of all, you have to log in into your pre-release or summer 24. And before that, let me tell you what is this personal level. So now user can apply and their own levels to the record and to help them organize, track and find the records they need quickly and easily. Add levels to record related to a reason, project, campaign or anything else that helps keep your work organized and the levels that use add to records and separate from the levels that are added to the to-do list or any kind of things, right? So that is very helpful for us if you want to navigate and your branding of the records so you can use these levels. So first of all, you have to do one thing. Under the app launcher, you can see this app launcher. Just click on this app launcher and search select labels. Just click on these labels. Once you clicked on the label, you cannot see any label right now because it's a new org and this is a fresh org. So you have to create your own. So just click on new. Let's say account one. Okay, click save and new because I want to create two labels for two records. Okay, you can create any label or any records based on your need for your better understanding purpose i am showing this demo to you okay so let's say count two just click on the save so we have two labels once you clicked on the labels right so here we have labels so just click on labels like all my labels so you can see like account one account two right once you open the account one we don't have any record to assign this label right we will see this one how we can assign the records and click on this account too. Now you can see still we don't have any records regarding these labels. So how we can make it this, you know, user friendly and everything. So just open the account. Let's say new tab. I want to open the account record page. And once you open any record page, let's say this one, or you can click on this list view and click on the all records. Click any record as you have, let's say this record. And uh, also another thing before specific record, you can add like multiple you know add label based on your selection let's say this one this one and click on this button that is new button that is assign label right so let me select this first record right like uh, burlington and click on this assign label once you click on this assign label is asking the label because label is a you know lookup so you can search let's say we already created like account like account one so let me select this label account one save this okay and also in this record as well so there are two ways to assign the label like uh, this one and uh, inside the record as well so let me click on this record and uh, this time i want to click on this edit label here you can see right just click on this edit label and search like account 2 so this is the account 2 click on the save and once you clicked on the save now under the account record page we have two you know records and we already assigned two labels for these two records so in the all labels once you refresh this list view okay and uh, once you refresh it now you can open the label let's say account one and once you click on account one now you can see the label account one we have one uh, record of this label right same thing we can see for the other level that is account two and account two also have one record you can add a number of records inside one level or right or multiple levels we can assign to the uh, records as well okay so we already assigned but uh, in the record is specific once you clicked on this uh, records here let's say this one and uh, I want to show my label inside this record page so how do we can add that label inside the record page so if you want to add that record you know labels in the record page so just click on this gear icon click on this edit page and once you click on this edit page now under the lightning and builder page you can add that label inside the record page and based on label you can easily navigate that to labels so now under the standard component you have to search like labels like labels my labels drag and drop anywhere as you want let's say here i just drag and drop here that uh, particular labels now account to so just click on the save activate and once you click on this activate assign to org 
it will be asked to you for this all like assign a default all next save this once you save it now you have to go back from here and once you go back under the record page you will be see one label in the right panel we already added in at the my level you can see the account to so this record have account to label so it's inter you know it's a linking between the uh, label and record so once you clicked on the account to now immediately it's navigate that particular levels like account to and under the account to we have this uh, record once you clicked on this record now immediately you can navigate again that particular records that is the functionality right also you can check another you know account to and account to have burlington or let's say ac account one have burlington so let's see the burlington here once you click on burlington you can add that to particular you know that labels inside that record page so let's say i want to add here so let me click on this lightning i builder page and once you clicked on this lightning i builder page now you can add your labels inside here right so there are so many ways to add it so this is the one way okay so under the lightning builder page under the standard you have to search like label like labels you can drag and drop like this click on the save and once you clicked on the save activate assign to all next save this and go back so once you go back here now you immediately you will be seeing this burlington record page have this label account one once you clicked on this account one immediately it's navigate that particular you know user defined level so now you can see the account one level have this record if you want to add like multiple record for this level you you can also add it so let me tell you how we can add okay so let's say under here click on this account i want to add another record for account account one level click on this all account let's say jenny point also you can add here you can also add your level let's say account one right like account one also like uh, account two click on the save now you can see the two label so once you open any label this record it's common for these two labels right like account one account two so once you go here in the label let me tell you how we can see this one like all my account one click this account one now you can see the journey point right account two also have this journey point let's see so under here you can see that any point so this is the common for one right so once you clicked on that particular you know this one let's say jenny point so it's automatic redirect and you can see the label here so i hope you can easily understand this label this is very most important and these two level is associate this you know record these two levels okay so this associate these two records like that okay so this is the one way and this is the this is for a standard object you can add this personal label for the custom object as well so how we can see that so just go to the setup here click on the setup and once you clicked on the setup now you have to create a new custom object so let me click on the object manager and let me create a new object with custom object it can be anything uh, in my case i'm using any name as you want let's say demo object teacher object student employee anything as you want because these all custom so let's say teacher object let's say teacher and the plural name teachers like that okay so let me add the you know custom tab so that's why we can easily understand or we can easily find out that one so let me open it click on this click next next include all just click on the save now we have custom object that is teacher let me open the teacher because we already created the tab like teacher just click on this teachers and once you open the teacher so now here you, you can see the two teacher right so teacher Rohit and Amit so we can assign the custom level for this one as well not custom level that is personal level right so let me open any record so this uh, we can assign directly here let's say this one this record we can assign the label let's say and also you can see the assign assigning label to two records so let's say account we can assign account one label for this one and under this one let me open the account or sorry let's say label right click on this label and once you open the label 
click on this account one now immediately you can see two accounts and two teacher right Rohit and Amit you can navigate from here as well so we can assign the personal level for the custom as well the standard object so this is how we can use this uh, organize and find records easily with personal levels so guys i hope you learned something new in this video if you feel like this is the very more informative for us so please like share comments also you can subscribe the channel also you can turn on the bell icon for more updates so you never will miss any kind of update from my side so till then bye bye take care see ya thank you for watching guys